Mama. You could call me Honey. Hey guys, welcome to Trey. Today we're on a Princess Connect Redive summoning video. I think the video will be summoning on the very first Princess Gala, I think is what it's called. <laughs> so, yeah, this is like if you guys play Galia Lost. The banner is the same thing, like it basically doubled the rates. Or if you guys play Grand Fantasy, it's like the Flash Gala and the Premium Gala. So, essentially, the rates are basically doubled. But the feature rate is basically the same, so. Yeah, it's to be honest with you, not much changed. The only thing that's good about the Princess Gala is the double rate up, but at this point, I kind of have most of the characters in this game. <laughs> so, let me show you guys really quick. Say, so, yeah, I'm only missing three of the non limited three star characters, so yeah. <laughs> For the most part, I'll be pulling dupes, but it's okay. Like, I don't really mind pulling dupes because I get the Divine Amulet, so yeah, but I have enough to five star Christina if I can pull her, or rather, I will pull her. I just that how many, you know, jewels did it take for me to pull her? Because my last summoning video on this game was horrible. Like, it was bad. <laughs> I was summoning on the Summer Carol banner and basically had to pull to the Mercy to get her. And we got her in the last pull, like 298 pulls in. So I basically got 50 Divine Amulets after that, so <laughs> it wasn't really worth it. I really wish that they put more characters in the exchange lineup. Like, I don't like how there's only one character here. I wish there like, some other characters here as well. That way, you know, if I pulled 300 times I can get another character but I don't know maybe they might change that in the future but yeah so this banner is only here for three days so yeah <laughs> there is a better banner with Christina on it sometime around New Year's so it comes with New Year's you both of those characters are actually really good it's like it's kind of smart for you guys to wait until New Year's that way you can pull for both Christina and New Year's you but yeah I don't really want to wait <laughs> I've been saving up all my jewels so I really want to pull now not only that but Christina's rate is like half in that banner so it's like 0.35 percent chance to pull her and well as new year's you but chances are you're probably gonna pull one of them before you know you get to the mercy so yeah i don't know it depends on what you guys want to do like christina is actually a really good unit like she's still good to this day in jp and jp is like what like two years ahead of us <laughs> so three years later i could be wrong but three years later she's still good like that's crazy so that's why i really want to pull for her and I kind of been itching the pulse. <laughs> so yeah, there's 0.7% chance for her. So yeah, and then the 5% 3 star rate, which I feel like it should be, you know, the normal rates. <laughs> I don't think, you know, gacha games should have lower than the 5% SSR rate, but whatever. <laughs> but anyways, enough family, let's get into it. That's what we've been waiting for! It's what we wanted all along! Let's go. Okay, so I had 13 tickets, so let's use the tickets first. Yeah, okay. Wait, they gotta add a way to do multiple tickets because I hate doing, you know, tickets one by one. <laughs> but, yeah, hopefully you guys pull Christina and we got pulling for her. Like, she is a very sought-after unit. Like, not only she's really good, but, you know, she's a pretty cool character as well. Like, her design's really cool and stuff. And, you know, <laughs> she got the good stuff, but, <laughs> yeah, like, oh man, like, she looks really cool. Like, I definitely want to get her for sure. And she's definitely going to be one of the characters that I like, 5-star immediately. So I'm not sure what the next character I'm going to 5-star. I have actually have enough to, you know, 5-star 2 characters. So, yeah. Christina's one of them. And then I'm going to wait until someone else. Maybe, like, Summer Saren. I think she's really good as well. But we'll see. <laughs> like, I, I kind of want to save those for, like, limited characters. So, yeah. But I've been playing this game a lot lately. <laughs> like, you guys will see... The difference in level and stuff. It's actually been a while since I did my last video on this game, but <laughs> I think the last time I did a video on this game was like I was what level maybe like 60, 70 ish? I don't know. <laughs> but now I'm like level 100. Almost there to the, the cap. I, I definitely want to catch up. It's kind of easy to catch up like and level up in this game compared to other games. Like it's crazy. <laughs> Not only that, but level is actually you know really important in this game. Whereas some of the games, like levels don't really matter. It's just there for. I don't know, just basically to show how long you guys played the game. <laughs> in this game, it levels matter because the characters can only level up as far as you are, so... Yeah, which is kind of cool, but at the same time, I don't really like that. Because <laughs> I'd rather just max out a character, like, and not have to wait for me to level up. Because it does take a little bit, so... Yeah, but it doesn't really matter. I'm almost there to, like, the level cap anyway, like, 
I think it's like 112, so... <laughs> yeah, we're almost there. But... Oh my goodness. Seven poles in. Or there's, well, I think it was eight poles. <laughs> oh man, I'm curious to see how this video is gonna go. <laughs> like, I'm not sure if I get shafted again, like, no usual, or what, but... <laughs> I've been waiting for this banner for so long, so I'm like, I'm really hoping I'm gonna get shafted. <laughs> I, I wanna save for other characters as well, like, I know then like, the second year, there will be a whole bunch of characters that actually, like, needed in this game, like, Summer Saren, the New Year's Dew, like, so many other characters, like, I don't know all of them, but, you know, like that, but next year is gonna be all the collab banners as well, so I'm like, oh my god, like, they're going insane, so, <laughs> yeah, the next year is gonna be crazy, like, definitely try to save as much jewels as you possibly can, because, my god, <laughs> there's so many good characters that you actually need, or you, know, you don't really need it, but it'd be nice to have them. <laughs> like, for me, I don't really play this game for anything other than like the PvE. Like, PvP system is great. Like, I, I do it just to get the jewels, but once you get the jewels, like it's kind of like whatever. <laughs> and then the clan battles, I don't really care too much about. And the there's one more thing, the Luna Tower is kind of fun, but it kind of gets repetitive. So, yeah, <laughs> I kind of like the PvE just to, like to experience the story. And that's kind of about it, so... Yeah, alright, come on. There's the last one. Alright, should I do seven singles after this? That way, you know, it'll be so weird. <laughs> I don't know, I might do seven singles after this. Come on. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Okay. But at least get a whole bunch of Divine Amulets. Which I don't really need. But I'm definitely gonna need in the future, for sure. But yeah, I have 50,000 jewels. <laughs> uh, most of it came from the... The reset from the... PvP thingy, I think it was like the battle arena or Prince, uh, it was battle arena that, that reset. Princess arena didn't reset yet, but I'm looking forward to that resetting because I want some more jewels. <laughs> After this banner, I'm probably gonna be broken this game, so I definitely need as much jewels as possible. Like I can still farm some jewels from the the story stuff. But I really don't want to empty out my reserves, so <laughs> I kind of want to you know save those, but. Yeah, <laughs> uh, I'm not even sure how next year gonna go. <laughs> All right, former pole them into multis. Oh man, I can't believe you know a unit you know coming out in like the first year of the game can still stay relevant. <laughs> that, that's it's kind of cool when you think about that. Cause a lot of games like in mobile games, and gotcha games, like the unit that released like, in like the first year cannot compare to like the units in the second year and third year. But in this game, it's kind of cool how they can, you know, compete, and some of them are actually pretty good, you know, compared to the, you know, newer characters, so, yeah, it, it's kind of cool. But, yeah, that's why I'm, like, really, you know, looking forward to, like, using her and, you know, building her, because I think she'll help me a lot with the, all this stuff as well, like, especially story, like, story, I think I'm stuck on chapter 14. <laughs> I, I think, yeah, it's chapter 14. I can't beat the, the the raptor boss, I think. So, yeah, I, I think this game right now, I think they'll release up to chapter 17? 16 or 17, I don't know. But let's move on to the multi summons. Alright, let's go. But look, her animation looks really cool too. It's kind of like the Matrix. <laughs> oh man. Like she's like glitching around and stuff. Like, it's really cool. But yeah, I, I definitely gotta turn on the animations again. <laughs> like, I kinda turn off the animation because it takes a while to do dailies and stuff, so that's why I turn it off. But yeah, I'm gonna skip the summon. I'm gonna skip the summon that we don't get a 3 star. That way, we can save some time. So, yeah, okay, so let's pull 40. Uh, I think also in the future in this game, they're gonna be changing the way the summoning works. So, I think with the sparking, I think they're gonna. Ooh, we gotta. 3 star character, could this, could this be her? <laughs> uh, hopefully, hopefully. That way I, I can save some jewels, but... Come on, please. Please? Or if it's not her, please be a character I don't have. <laughs> uh, but at this point, I, I kind of have everybody, so... Yeah, come on, please. 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 On the next one. You stupid. Let's go! Is new? Is this her? Stupid. No, I don't, I don't think so. Yeah, not <laughs> oh, I'll take it. New character. Oh, that, that's awesome. Okay. I'm not sure if she's really that great. I think she's like one of those characters that is pretty decent now, but will eventually fall off. So, 
that's cool. <laughs> I'm glad we actually got a character I didn't have. <laughs> like you guys saw my last video on the Summer Carol banner, I kept pulling dupes, like dupe three stars, even though I didn't have like half the characters <laughs> in the the roster. So <laughs> at least like half of the three star characters in the roster. So yeah, I'm just glad we pulled someone new. <laughs> but let me just check it out really quick. So that was so cool. Look at that. What the heck is this? Oh, I think it's like. I don't know what that is. <laughs> Alright, but listen to her voice line. I think they have different voice lines. I could be wrong, but I guess we'll listen to them anyway, so let's go. Alright, so, yeah, for the most part, I feel like a lot of the 3 star characters, or I guess characters in general, when you pull them and you listen to the voice line, it's kind of just re saying their summoning lines again, so. Yeah, I, I don't know if that was unique. Ooh, no, 3 star, okay. Let, let's go, let's go. Okay, come on, please be her. 2! Okay, too. You can see that you know double rate in three stars, but yeah, the rate in the game isn't really that great. It's like 2.5% chance. Like <laughs> it's not good. Oh, come on, please. One of them gotta be her, okay? One of them gotta be her. If it's her, you guys will definitely hear the music. But all right, please. <laughs> okay, June. Okay, I'll, I'll take her. <laughs> oh man, this is the first time I actually pulled June, but I, I'll take her. She's really good. Now that 50 to my ambulance. So all right, please. Next one. It is like foreshadowing. I think June and. Christina are kind of like friends, I guess, or co workers or something, so it could be foreshadowing her, but let's go, let's go, let's go, someone new, okay, someone new. Hey, let's go, let's go. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, I, I don't really want to do the thing yet, but alright, I think she's done talking, so let's go. Whoa. <laughs> oh man, that's awesome. Look at the background too, that's amazing. It's literally foreshadowing, you know, her. <laughs> that's amazing. Not only that, but oh, look at her, she looks so good. Like, she definitely, you know, mommy material, but <laughs> let's go, okay. Alright, so, uh, how long is the video? 14 minutes. You know what, let, let's, let's upgrade it to 5 star, let's do it together. <laughs> Why not? Uh, how many of summons have done in this manner? I think I've done less than 100, I think. So. I can be out of here. Look at that. Oh, it's beautiful. 50. This game being nice to me again. Uh, I remember it took me forever to get Summer Carol. I pulled Picarine in like, you know, 30 something pulls. So, oh man, I can finally save my jewels for other characters. Like, I basically have enough to Mercy. <laughs> That's cool. I'll probably be pulling for New Year's You when she comes out. Like, hopefully next year, this game will be good to me. And I can pull every character really quickly. Because <laughs> next year, it's going to kill me. <laughs> But there we go, I can I can save now, that's awesome. Alright, so let's go check it out. Actually, how many things does it take for her to get to the 5 star? Let's see, 120, I think it's 150, so I think it's 270. So, I guess we'll do that right now, so let me go into this shop really quick. So, where like that is. There we go, okay. So, Divine Amulet, okay, and then... You know what really cool? If you can unlock characters using the Divine Amulets. Like, I guess it'd be kind of cheap <laughs> if you can do that, but it'd be kind of nice if you could do that. Like, or at least for, like, the the non-limited 3 stars. That'd be kind of cool. I don't think you can purchase, you know, shards for characters you don't have. So, yeah. <laughs> that kind of stinks, but there we go. She's right here on the bottom. So, that's max, right? Yeah. Actually, it does change the, the price, so. Yeah, okay, so this is 20. So... Now it's gonna be like, yeah, two each. Oh, this hurts. <laughs> 20, so we gotta get to 270, I think. So hopefully I'm right. Hopefully I'm not wasting it. So, that's 40. Oh my god, that's so expensive. Oh, this hurts me. I've been saving these Divine Amulets for such a long time for a character that's really worth using on, and this is the first time I'm using it, and it hurts. <laughs> 80, okay. Alright, so I think 5 is like the max. Or does it keep going? Does it keep getting higher? I said there we go, that's 120 right there. And yeah, it stays at 5. Okay, that's cool. How about now? 150. Ooh, okay. Brings it all the way there. Okay, that's beautiful. 750. Oh my god, it's so expensive. <laughs> Alright, let's, let's do it. Oh, it hurts me. 
Oh man. <laughs> uh, and after that, like getting character six stars. I'm not sure if you need the shards or not to get them six stars, but yeah, it's gonna hurt as well. Hopefully by then I have some more divine amulets, but yeah, there we go. So we can get it to five star now, so let's do it. Okay, so Ascension. But I don't think her arch changes, right? I think it just stays the same. So that kind of stinks, but whatever. Let's go. So it's four star now. Yeah, it'd be nice if their art changed. Like, I think it only changes for 3 stars and 6 stars. So, yeah, I'm not sure. Did she get a 6 star version in the future? Well, I'm pretty sure eventually she will, but I'm not sure if JP has one. You know, a 6 star version of her yet, but... Alright, let's go. 5 star. It's too bad I can't really see what her stats are <laughs> when it's like fully maxed out because I'm, I'm kind of ascending her at like level 1. So, <laughs> like, I can't really see how much it increased, but whatever. All right, there we go. Okay, so five star. Okay, so let me can I work on it right now? Let's see. It was good. Yeah, low all the two. Oh my god, good. I've got <laughs> I gotta rank them up too. All right, so let me get them to like rank four. I think that's how you lock all. No, rank seven is when you get all the skills. So I kind of want to see what her skills does. Like I want to see why she's so good. <laughs> yeah, I don't really understand why she's good. So yeah, I only know that she does a lot of damage. <laughs> so let's figure it out. So let me just quickly do this. Oh, it takes so many like mana to upgrade a character and as well as all the, the equipment. So it's kind of a pain. <laughs> like it takes forever to upgrade characters in this game. So yeah, for most part, I kind of get all characters to like nine out of six. That way they're at least usable. And right now I'm trying to level up all my characters to like the max level. And then, you know, I will work on them. But I guess I'm playing the game wrong. <laughs> I probably shouldn't be doing that, but for some reason I love, love all the characters to like the max level, so... Yeah, okay, so let's see what she does. So this, what's this? Deal large physical damage to enemy directly in front. Okay, dodge physical attacks for a set. Oh, that's pretty good. This attack number is it? Ooh. Always... Okay, I, I see why. <laughs> that, that's pretty good. Overlay. Moderate boost on physical attack. And Okay, so that's pretty decent. And yeah, let's see what else is there. Deals moderate physical damage to enemies directly in front and lower the physical damage. Okay. And with this one. Okay, so yes, basically she does a lot of damage. <laughs> but her union burst is actually really good, so let me do this. Oh my god. <laughs> Look how much it takes. 7 million mana. Just for one character, that's insane. But granted, you know, I love to go to like level 100, so <laughs> yeah. Not even like half my characters that have, you know, level 100, you know, like skills, so. Yeah, she's like the first one. But let's see how far I can get her to. I don't think I have all the, the equipment, so. But she's pretty decent right now. Like, she's good enough. Yeah, I don't have all of them. I'm missing, like, some of them, but that's fine. But I probably work on that when there's, like, a two-time drop rate. So, yeah, I might just get her to, like, rank 9. That's kind of about it. So, that's cool. So, that's awesome. <laughs> but I did not expect to pull her so quickly, but I'm really glad I did. That way I can save up for the the craziness of next year. But hopefully I have good luck on this banner. We got the polling. Hopefully, guys, all pull Christina and we got to pull her because she's really good. If not, then hopefully, you guys, pull her, you know, in the New Year's U banner. Or we got saving for that banner. Hopefully, you guys, pull both you and Christina. Like, that's insane. <laughs> oh my goodness. But yeah, I could not wait. I had to pull for her. Like, she's awesome. So, yeah. <laughs> anyways, if you guys want more Princess Connect Redie summoning videos, be sure to like and subscribe button. I plan on doing more of this game. But, anyways, the next video is probably going to be on the New Year's U banner. So, it'll be a while away. So. Yeah, I'm not sure if I want to do a gameplay video on this game. Like, I'm not really that great at this game, so... I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> and like, I'm not sure you guys want to see it, but yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys later.